where have I been for a while? Well, um, you can see my beard has grown in. It's because I don't have any free time anymore because I started a new job where I'm working uh, 12 to 13 hour days, six to seven days a week. And I'm just all the time, work, work, work. Don't fret for me though, because it's the first time in my whole career that I'm being paid for my overtime. So I'm actually making quite a bit of money. So one of the things that I did with some of that money was take advantage of a Lion Brand sale where they were getting rid of a bunch of yarn for a dollar a cake. So I've been sitting on this box for a week because I've been working. I haven't had time to shave or get a haircut or make a video or knit anything really. Let's see what this looks like. So the idea here was that you could get a whole lot of yarn or you could get yarn for a dollar a cake. It was mostly cakes. Provided you would buy 1,000, no wait, not 1,000, 60 yarn, yarns, uh, or 90 or 45, it depended on which one you got. I decided to go for Lion Brand Cupcake. So we're gonna take a look at what I got. Wow, that's a lot of yarn already. Invoice. Let's take a look from my angle. So there they are. Uh, it, you, had to buy, you had to buy one color. So I was thinking of this idea, this grand scheme, because they had like 12 different colors. And I thought, what if, because you had to buy 60 of them, what if I found six friends and we each bought a box and then we could each keep 10 of each color, we could trade them. All right, and now I'm seeing that it wouldn't work easily because these come in packs of three. But look at this insanity it's 60 <laughs> and it's all the same color because I don't actually have any friends so I I didn't know anybody who would go in on this deal with me and I was too busy at work to try to find anybody so and then I lingered too long I waited a couple of days and they started to disappear and I went oh no I gotta pick whatever's left so I spent like an hour <laughs> looking uh, when I should have been sleeping I'm getting very little sleep these days and I picked this color, which is, if I remember correctly, yes, it's Happy Dance. So here's the thing. Each of these is uh, 500 and something yards. What is it? 590 yards. That's 540 meters. 150 grams each. It's uh, DK weight, uh, number three on the Craft Yarn Council scale. So 590 yards times 60, I think is like 1 million, no, not a million. It's um, 35,400 yards. So it's enough to make a sweater. Uh, it's enough to make a lot of sweaters. Um, I'm not necessarily in love with self-striping yarns. I know they're a big deal right now. And I follow a, a D-Stash group on Facebook and anytime Anytime a cake appears, like they descend in mass and they like ship into this, how much I want it. And especially if someone has like five of them, who look out. Uh, anyway, so I thought even if I'd never use all of these, I could certainly sell off bags of these things easily enough, especially because this is kind of a nice color. It's called Happy Dance. And what I was thinking would be kind of cool though, is actually reclaiming the colors or you find where the color changes and snip it and then join them together. And then I could have an enormous amount of each of these colors. And I picked this one because I liked the colors individually. So it would, uh, it would be nice to do some self-striping work. But for me, I'm not too big on self-striping clothing, you know, like baby clothes and stuff like that. If I was gonna self-stripe, and I have, and in fact, I'm doing one right now um, in Lion Brand Mandala, I think. By the way, I thought people were mispronouncing. Somebody online was calling it Mandala, and I said it's Mandala. And then a little while later, I was like, wait, is it Mandala? I don't actually know. I, I'm just making that up. And I looked it up, and I'm wrong. It's Mandala. So don't think you know everything. So uh, I think it's just going to be fun to take pictures, like lay this out and take pictures of this much yarn or like bury myself under it. But uh, also, I thought it would be kind of cool to cut it in pieces and join them in together into giant skeins of the same color. 
because it's it wasn't so much that I wanted 60 skeins of this kind of self-striping yarn. It's that I wanted uh, 35,000 yards, 35,400 for only 60 bucks. So that's a dollar, a dollar, a dollar. Every one of these is a dollar. So, look at this. Isn't that insane? It looks like a yarn store. It looks like something just arrived and I have to, you know, price it and put it out on the shelves. <laughs> so, I'm, I guess I, you know, I was too old for the Pokemon craze, but I do have that collector's mentality where I want to collect them all. And they're like, did you know you can get a hundred of anything? And I'm like, ooh, I want it. Give it, give it to me. I need a hundred of it. Because it just frees you up. It gives you ideas. Now I have all kinds of new things I might be able to do with this. Or maybe I'll just sit on it forever and then sell it when I'm old. Who knows? Who knows?